Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Cupboard, I'm Penge, and welcome to K2 Digital Edition, which is the PC version of the board game K2, where we play cards to help climbers reach the summit of the mountain and pick up some victory points along the way. So we have to balance the health of our climbers with the speed of the climb. If our climbers die whilst out on the mountain, then we don't get to keep their victory points, because it's not really a victory if they've died a bit, is it? So we have to make sure the climbers are healthy, but also that they are making their way up the mountain at a steady pace to pick up the victory points so we can claim a glorious win. Now this is the demo of the game, it's on Steam right now as I record this, and as always there's a link to the Steam Store page in the video description so you can check the game out a little bit more and also have a go at the demo if you would like to. And just before we begin, I think it might be worth pointing out that I don't really know anything at all about mountain climbing. I don't know the terminology and the do's and don'ts and the equipment or anything else. All I know is that it looks difficult, very difficult, very dangerous, and also cold, very, very cold. Always pack thermal underpants when mountain climbing. That's what I always say before I go and climb a mountain. But you know what? Apart from that, I'm sure we're going to be fine. What could possibly go wrong? So here we go. Let's go and climb up a mountain, shall we? Okay, so we have two different ways to play the game. We could either make a single trip or we could play a campaign. Now, because we're playing the demo of the game, we can only make single trips up the mountain of K2 itself, which does sort of check out. That does seem to make sense because the game is called K2. So I kind of get why they've done that. In the full version of the game, you can climb up different mountains. There's Mount Everest and Broad Peak. And then this one here, I've never heard of this. Lots of lot say i don't know where that is again i don't know much about mountain climbing but there we go so in the full version of the game you can make single trips up many many different mountains with all sorts of different difficulty levels these things here these little icons i don't know what they are either some sort of ice pick type things they represent difficulty so that's quite straightforward that's a little bit more challenging and the one at the end there the south face of lohotsa is very difficult indeed but i think what we're going to do is have a go at the campaign there are three different campaign levels that one is nice and easy that one's sort of okay that one's a bit challenging and there isn't a super difficult one so do you know what let's dive in and have a go at this one here chapter one long preparations okie doke here we go there is the mighty mountain of k2 and we can see all the different routes that we can take to get from the bottom to the top because there isn't just one set path it does branch out a little bit so we can pick and choose as we go along there is the summit over there and then of course we start at the bottom because i don't know that much about mountain climbing as we've established but i do know that when people begin climbing a mountain they tend to start at the bottom so there we go chapter one long preparations high mountain expeditions often require a lot of preparation yes i imagine they would because they're quite dangerous climbers usually go up and down the route several times to set up camps let's prepare to make the summit push possible okay so if we set up one camp we get a shiny bronze medal which is okay if we set up two camps we get a slightly shinier silver medal, which is a bit better than the bronze. And if we set up three camps, we get a very, very shiny medal indeed. It's a gold medal. That's the one we want. We want to go and do that, please. If any climber dies, you lose. Okay, right. That is a simple instruction. That is very straightforward. You pitch camps instead of regular tents. Okay, that's interesting. So I did do the tutorial and each character has their own tent. And they can pitch the tent on the mountain and then they can fall back to the tent if the weather's bad or if they're tired or whatever. It offers a little bit of shelter. But these seem to be different. The camps appear to be different things. Both climbers must be in the same place to pitch a camp there. Okay, so they've got to work together to pitch the camps. They can pitch their own tents wherever they like, but the camps have to be done in tandem, if you like. You're allowed to build camps only at marked positions. Okay, so we have to build camps at set points as well. Okay, right, that's fine. Let's dive in and have a little look around. So there we go. We control these two characters here. We control Mike with his goggles. Hello, Mike. And we control Monique. Hello there, Monique. I hope you're doing okay. So at the moment, they're down here at the bottom of the mountain and they're ready to go climbing up to the top. And there's a path up to the top and they can sort of move about all these different kind of locations. And yes, you'll notice they do have a little one next to them in a blue circle. That is their health. So at the moment, they're okay. They're sort of fine. They've got a little bit of health, but we do need to improve that. It can go up to six. It can go up to six health. And down here at the bottom of the mountain, it's not so bad. But if we look up at the top, we can see some locations have got red circles on them. That causes damage to their health. 
So down here at the bottom of the mountain, we've got blue circles. That means they pick up health. Hooray, it's good down here at the bottom of the mountain. They can stock up on health, but then when they start going a little bit higher, it's going to damage their health because, you know, the air is thinner and it's colder and it's all kind of tricky up there and such like. So we want to make sure that we really get a lot of health whilst they're at the bottom of the mountain and then it might not be so bad when they're kind of working their way up to the top. And I think, are they the camp locations? It looks like they might be camp locations. So there's one just there, and then one just there, and then one just there. Okay, right, so there are the three. Okay, they that, that one might not be so bad. That could be tricky, but that looks like it's very, very near to the summit. That might be quite a difficult one to do. Um, okay, right, so let's go and do something, shall we? So down here, we have a selection of cards. And yeah, because it's turn-based, we move in days, we've got ourselves three cards to pick for this particular day. So that card there, that's actually quite a good card. That has got a three and a blue health circle. So if we choose that and then we play it, the character that we apply it to will pick up three health which will be quite good. That'll set them up quite nicely to then go up here and do some of the bits and bobs. And these ones are movement cards. So if we see a little kind of hexagon thing and it's got some footprints around it, that means it's a movement card and we use movement cards to move around. Now we haven't got any here, but there are special movement cards that help us move up and down the mountain a bit quicker because sometimes you might want to come down the mountain in case, you know, the weather's really bad in a particular bit, or you need to get back to a camp or a tent or whatever. So there are special cards that mean that we can move up and down the mountain slightly quicker, but we haven't got any of those here. So never mind. So what we're going to do is we'll take that because that's three health for somebody, and that's quite good. We'll take that because that's three movement. And then I'm not quite sure what that one does. That gives us no health. Okay, that's a bit strange, but we'll pick that one because that's another movement point. So there we go. We confirm the end of the planning phase. So that's all fine. Choose weakness points. Okay. What a weakness points game. This did not, this did not pop up in the tutorial. I don't know what weakness points are. Um, okay, I mean, it looks like we have to pick from one of three things but they're all saying minus one. Okay, do you know what? I'm going to pick the middle one. We're going to pick the middle minus one weakness point. Okay, so we have minus one weakness point. Right, I don't know what that does. What's I don't know what a weakness point does. Hang on, can we go and look in the help and discover what weakness points are all about? Weakness points represent some of the challenges of mountain climbing. After the planning phase, the player who has the most movement on these selected cards must choose weakness points. Each minus one takes away one movement from your cards. Oh, I see. I see. Right, so they're going to wear us down a bit, are they? So yeah, it becomes quite tricky moving about the mountain. If there's no movement left, each minus one weakness point takes away one health point from the selected climber. Oh, that's not very good. Weakness tokens are pulled out of four zeros, 11 minus ones and five minus twos. Once selected, it does not return to the pool. Oh, okay, right, there's a pool of weakness tokens. Okay, so we've got, hang on, how many is that? 11, 15, 16, there's 19 of those tokens, and I think we play across 18 days. So, okay, so there is quite a high chance that we're going to lose one movement point every day. We might lose two movement points in a day, or we possibly might have no weakness at all. Okay, right, that's an interesting thing. Okay, so let's maybe, I don't know, who wants the um, who wants the nice health boost? So we'll pick Monique, and Monique, you can get yourself three additional health points. So you're up to four, which is pretty good. And because they're on a tile which gives them one anyway, at the end of the day, at the end of our turn, they're going to pick up another health point. So Monique is going to be looking pretty good, I think. So maybe Monique... Could you do some moving? Oh yeah, look down here, look. That card now has a minus one applied to it. So that did give us three movement points. Now, because of that weakness thing, it gives us two. Okay, right, and then to move about, you don't sort of pick the movement cards directly. You pick where you want the uh, climbers to move to and they will just use the cards accordingly. So how about we move, let's move Monique over a little bit, shall we? So we've got, what's that? We've got three movement points in total. So how about we move you to there and then we can move Mike over to here. There we go. Weakness points. How does it work? If there's no movement left, each one takes away one health point from the selected climber. Oh, 
Oh no, that's... Oh, okay, hang on. Mike's going to lose his point because he's got the minus one... He's got the minus one weakness point on him, but then he's going to gain a point of health because he's on a space which gives him health. Oh, that's that's probably not great, is it? Oh, that's a bit of a nuisance. Okay, right, never mind. Yeah, Mike used that card, and there's no there's nothing left on that card. Oh, botherations. Okay, never mind, never mind. Sorry, Mike. I mess that up a little bit, but I'm getting used to this whole sort of concept. Um, okay, so Monique could, in theory, move to there. She could move another point. Oh, she's got minus one on hers. Oh, I see. Is it different for each person? No. Hang on a minute. Hang on, now I am confused. How does that work then? It's on Monique. Oh no, hang on. If we choose Monique, we'll have the minus one movement point on her. And that means that Mike isn't going to take that hit. Okay, yeah. So the weakness point can be on Monique's card there. Yeah, okay, right. End of the day. And now we get a planning phase. But the weather has turned a bit up. Here we can see the weather. So now the top of the mountains. So the mountains kind of split into four bits, I think. There's the very peak at the top. Then there's sort of two levels down. Then three levels down. And then the fourth level is the nice safe one that we're on. So now on Sunday... It's particularly challenging up on the mountain. The top three bits are all in red. That's quite bad. I mean, that bit there, look, the weather on Tuesday just affects that kind of this middle bit here. How does the weather not affect the top of the mountain? How does that work exactly? I'm not really sure, but okay. Um, right. So Monique, I think, will be ready to go climbing because by the time she gets up here, she's going to have six health. So she's going to be looking pretty good. So how about... We pick three movement points for Monique, and then two, and then another two. And we'll just try and move people around a bit. Yeah, okay, so end our phase. Choose weakness points. Okay, I think for now, let's pick a minus one. Because we want to keep the zeros for when we're at the top. Because now we're just moving around the sort of happy bottom bit of the mountain. It's fine. So we'll have a minus one. Um, and then, yes, okay, so you can move to... Uh, I'd say, here, is it on that card? Can we pick which card it goes on to? It's on that card there. Okay, hang on a minute. Monique, you go to, uh, you go to here. So that might use up three. Uh, yeah, you go to there, please. Okay, so we've moved around a bit. So Monique has used a few, so she's used all of that one up and that one. Okay, bit of this one too. Okay, right, so Mike... I think you move to here, and that's it. Use one movement point, I would say, to shuffle in... Oh, no. It's gone to there. Okay, shuffle over again, then. So, like that. So, Mike's used up two movement points from that. Monique's used three from there. So, if we go to Monique and move you... That's two, look, because now this is a bit trickier. That takes two movement points to move up the mountain because they've got to do actual climbing now. Uh, we could put her over there for one, but I think I think we keep it like it is. I think it's okay unless could we move Mike along one to there and then the weakness point won't bother him. Yeah, let's do that. Mike, you go there and yeah, that weakness point won't do anything to you. Yeah, okay, right. End of the day. So already on day three. And we haven't even got anywhere near setting up a camp yet. Crikey's. Um, okay, no healing things. But Monique is fully healed anyway. So that's okay. And uh, there we go. There's a special kind of climbing card. So that allows us to climb up one. So up one, like a regular moving point. But we can come down three. So we can really kind of quickly abseil down if we're in a bit of a panic. Um, okay, we'll take that. We'll take that and we'll take that. I don't know what that one does because it's got zero in it and I don't fully understand. That must have some sort of special effect or something. Uh, okay, so like that. Um, we could get a minus two weakness points thing out of the way. We could just sacrifice that card. That card could go. Do you know what? We will take that. Um, yeah, on that card there. So if we go to Monique and oh, hang on, no, go to Mike. Mike, move up here for one. Okay, that's fine. And then we're just going to skip. We're going to skip our turn. Mike will get a point of health from being on here, which is good. And yeah, we've we've got rid of one of the minus two weakness things. So yeah, there we go. End of the day. And here we go. Right, that's what we wanted to see. 
some sort of health things coming in from Mike. So if we take one of those, apply that to Mike, his health will go up to five. And then if we move up here, his health will eventually go up to six, which means they'll both be on six. And then we can start climbing up the trickier bits of the mountain. So we'll have that. And then we'll take that and that. Okay, so end the planning phase. We'll take another minus one weakness point thing. It's on that. That's fine. Okay, Mike, you have that thing. There you go. So you're on five health, which is good. And then we need you to move to here. But that's two movement points. Well, we haven't got two. We've got, well, we've got two in total. But then the weakness thing's going to kick in and you're going to lose your health that we just gained. Okay, no, right, skip again. There's a lot of standing around on the mountain, but it's fine. We're being safe. Okay, end the day. Right, and now we need to get moving. Okay, so how about we have that and that and that. They're both nice and kind of rested. That's fine. So end that phase. We will take... Oh, do we take a minus? We need quite a lot of points to work our way up the mountain now. We need 10 movement points to get one of them up there. So let's take a minus one for now then. We'll take a bit of, oh no, do we take a naught lug? And then they can both move over onto this, this tile here. Because that'll be two, three, and four. That gets us up two actually. Hang on, yeah, they'll both be able to get here. Okay, we'll take a naught this time round. And Mike, you go to here, and then Monique, you go to here. Okay, all of our movement points are done, and we've just shuffled up the mountain one tiny space. Okay, end the day. Day six out of 18. <laughs> we do need to get a little bit of a wriggle on. These are the last three cards. The deck will then be shuffled. Okay, this isn't going to do anything at all. Uh, okay, right. End. Oh, no. Okay, hang on end phase if we choose minus two weakness points um how's that gonna work because there's no movement on these and the weakness points sap movement so we're we gonna take a minus two and we're gonna see no look i think it's just gone i think that's wasted because we haven't got any movement cards so we can't do anything uh, oh no i think it's affecting monique i think it's affecting monique directly ah botherations okay uh monique We'll, we'll play that on you. I don't know if that does anything. You're going to lose two health. Uh, okay, can we do that on you? Seven out of... Oh, you can go over. Oh, she's a nine out of six. So she's going to lose those two, be on seven out of six, and it's not going to bother her. Wonderful. The cold never bothered her anyway. I, I believe that about you, Monique. Okay, end of the day. The deck is shuffled. Right. Now we can do some moving. Here we go. Two and three and three. Right. Let's get a bit of a wriggle on. So there are cards. Thank you. We'll pick a minus one. And then, right, Monique, you can go just there. Make your way to just there, please, Monique. And then you can come in here. I think you need to go to just there. Okay, so that's going to have your weakness point on it. Monique has got potentially one movement point left but it takes three to get over there okay i'm not sure we're going to be able to get up there and get the shiny gold medal i i, I don't think that's going to happen we've taken too long down at the bottom of the mountain having a lovely time building snowmen and having snowball fights and making snow angels all things to do with snow um yeah okay so mike yeah mike can't move it yeah okay so we'll leave that with mike end the day and now we get some more cards okay we've got some healing cards which we don't need because they're all fully healed and only a couple of movement cards botherations okay we'll put the one in like that for now in fact you know what we'll take that one end that phase so one person can oh hang on a minute if we choose two weakness points and then just don't move that gets an, an, another one of those out of the pool, if you like. Do you know what? We'll take that. Fine. And we can't do anything. We can't move anybody because these they've got the weakness things on them. So we can do whatever this thing does. I don't know what that does because it's got a zero on it. We're just going to play it. There you go, Mike. 
enjoy putting on a really snazzy outfit and having a fun time. And, um, okay, that was a non-event day, wasn't it? Can we have some movement cards? There we go. Right, one and two and three. End the planning phase. Oh, crikey. Okay. We'll take a minus one because we do need to start moving up the mountain a bit. So, Mike, you... Get over there, please. Hooray! We've actually moved up onto the mountain a bit. <laughs> Finally. Um, okay. So we're over... Are we on this tile or that? We're on that tile, I think. Which is good. And then I think Monique is going to have to wait down here. Because then she's got the minus one movement thing. Okay. Right. That's fine. We're never going to get this done in another, what, eight days? We can barely move up the mountain at any pace. Um, one and one and one. Okay, and that will choose minus one. Weakness point. Those weakness points are proper killers. They make things very difficult. Um, okay, how how much is it to move up here? Can we move the camera around a bit? Can we sort of shuffle the camera about? I can't see how much it takes to get there because the chappy's in the way. Three. Oh, botherations. Okay, Mike, can you get over that? That takes three. Okay, we might have to sacrifice some of Mike's health, and then he can at least be at the point where we can set up a camp. Mike, you might take a bit of a hit. And he's going into an area with red, a red circle, so he's going to take damage from the environment anyway, unless Monique takes the point of damage. Okay, so she's going to take the damage from the weakness point, but that's all we can do. Okay. So, uh, right, we've got ourselves, yeah, the deck being shuffled in two rounds. So, we'll have that, that, and that. End that phase. Monique, oh, we'll have another minus one weakness point, please. Monique can heal herself. That's good. And then, can Monique make it to here? Hooray! Somebody's at one of the points where we can get a camp down. <laughs> Finally. Uh, and then Mike... I don't think you can do anything because you've got a weakness point thing. Okay, right, there we go. Confirm the end of the day. The final three cards are healing cards. End the phase. Um, minus two because that's fine. And Monique, you're going to take quite a bit of damage. So we'll do this thing again. So we shall give you plus three health, eight out of six. And then you can have whatever that is, ten out of six. And then you can have that one as well because that'll just keep you nice and safe. Right, end of the day, day 13. <laughs> we haven't even set up a camp yet. Okay, this is fine. Right, we'll take all the movement points we can. We will have no weakness points just to allow us to move because we've got five movement points. I think we can get up here. Why do we take minus two? Because then they're going to work together to set up a camp. And I think... Uh, hang on, Mike. We need Mike to go just there. It's three. So, do you know what? We'll take minus two, please. Clear that out of the pool. And then, Mike, you make your way just there. And then, here we go. It's, oh, botherations. It's two movement points to set up a camp. Okay. We haven't got those. So, we have got some healing cards next time. Do you know what? We're going to set up a camp. We're just going to do it, and then we're going to take the hit. But because they are in the camp, I think they do heal up a bit. Right, okay, so end of the day. Mike is down to three. We've got Monique on five. We will take that healing thing for Mike. We've got four days left. Can we make it to here and set up another camp? Can we at least get to just there and set up two and get a lovely silver medal? So we'll put that there and that there. Okay, so yes, please. We will have... No, hang on, how much did it get to there? Two. So we need five movement points to get to there. Okay, so one of them can make it to there fine. They're going to be okay, and the other one is going to have to catch up. Okay, we'll take no weakness points. Monique, you lead the way, so you can now get over there. And Mike, you can heal up a bit. So you heal up. Oh, hang on. Hang on, Mike can move as well. Because she had... Um, how did that work exactly? She had three. Oh, hang on. I don't fully understand, but okay, right, this is good news. Uh, right, Mike, you move to here. Hooray! Right, okay, so we're over here. It's sort of looking a bit dicier now, but it's fine. Right, 
day 15. We need to heal up Monique. So take a point of that for Monique just to heal her up ever so slightly. And then Mike needs to move in. And then, yes, we'll get a plus one kind of climbing arrow thing because he's going up here, look. Um, so, yeah, Mike. Oh, yeah, we'll confirm that. That's fine. So you can have the healing point, Monique. You can... Oh, hang on. Weakness points. We'll have minus one. You can have the healing point. There you go. You're welcome. And then, Mike, can you get to here? And then we can set up another camp. Okay. Right. We've got two camps. We've got a shiny silver medal. We need to get to here to set up the third. Is that even remotely possible? I do not know. Um, I think... Uh, where are we? So, Monique, yeah, we've got... That's got a minus one on it. And that's... Okay, right. We can't do anything today. So, we're going to have three days to try and get them both just there with a bit of movement left to set up a camp. Okay, I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Okay, so planning phase. Pick three cards. We'll have that one. And they're all slow movement cards, which is a little bit of a nuisance. And we have to pick a minus one weakness point thing. Okay, that's not going to help at all. So we could get Monique there. But I think she's got up three. So yeah, one, two, th up three and down four. Yes, because of course, one, two, three. We're going to move her there, I think. We're going to move her there. And then we're going to take the hit on that card. Okay, that's day 16. We're not going to get them both there, are we? And it's very cold there for Monique. She's going to take damage. Bother. Okay, right, skip. We can't let her die, though. We can't let Monique die. Uh, okay, we'll have a healing thing for Monique. We'll have a movement thing to maybe try and get Mike up a little bit. And then another movement thing, just because we can. We'll just desperately try. We'll have no weakness points, please. However, Monique is looking poorly. So you heal up, Monique. <laughs> and then, do we put you there? Do we put her there? Tomorrow is the last day of the expedition. Okay. We need to get you into here, I think. So, um, yeah, that's going to be... That's only one point. So only one point. Mike could get there for two points. If we're very lucky, we might be able to do this. We could possibly fluke this. Okay, Monique, you go there. Mike, you go here. That's all we can do. We need a lot of movement points. Hopefully that's not the end of the deck. Because if it is, oh, botherations. Okay. <laughs> We're going to fall short of a shiny gold medal, which is a little bit of a shame. Um, yeah, they're all the cards we can have. So end the phase. We'll choose no weakness points. Um, right, Mike is not looking too great. Monique isn't looking too great either. Um, but yeah, we can move We can move Mike in. We can move Mike up here, but then we can't do the tent thing. We can't get the camp set up, I don't think. There we go. But yeah, we've, got, we've not got enough movement points. We haven't got any. Ah, oh, we're a tiny bit short. That's very frustrating. Um, okay, Mike, you can heal up a bit. And that's all we can do. That's all we can do. I'm going to do that. I don't know what it does, but we've done it. And we're here. We needed one more day. One more day, and we could have got that final camp set up. Oh, well, then, never mind. Never mind. Do you know what? We'll take a silver. We'll take a nice silver. There we go. Right, so what is the next thing? Getting to the summit is optional. Getting down is mandatory. Yeah, indeed it is. Right, so we should have more or less the same kind of route. Ah, okay. I think somebody else went and sorted out the camp that we didn't do. Maybe we just did it on day 19 or whatever. So our two people are there. Okay, right, we've got different things now. So make a summit push at the right moment. Camps are fully equipped and give you safe shelter. Use them wisely. Okay, so now we have different things to get us the different shiny medals. And these are victory points. So 16 victory points gives us bronze, 18 for silver, 20 for gold. So we've got to get to the summit and return to camp safely. At camp, the climber's health will not drop below one. Okay, so we can look around now. And we can see that there are different victory points 
on each of these things. So down here, there is one victory point. There's one just there. And if we go there, we pick up those victory points. But of course, down here, there's there's not much glory in this bit because you know, this isn't that tricky. But at the top, look at that. 10 victory points for getting to the summit. However, our people seem relatively unprepared. They've only got one health each. That's not very good, folks. Come on, you could have done better than that. So how about we take a big health boosting card and maybe a big kind of movement card and move Mike, for example, from that camp to that camp. That might be quite good. So um, yeah, we'll have that and we'll just take that. I don't know what that does. So we'll take that and that can just kind of be out of our hand, if you like. Um... Oh, botherations. Okay. We can move Mike to here. If we move him there, he's going to take a point of damage from the weakness thing. I forgot about the weakness thing. Okay, we'll do that. So, Mike, give yourself three health up to four. And then, Mike, go along to here, please. So, we're now stopping here. We're going to get five lovely, lovely victory points, which is good. And then we'll just play that because I don't know what it does. I don't, I don't see the purpose of it, but okay, right. End of the day. Of course, we've got Monique over there looking pretty happy. Okay, let's now try and get Monique. Maybe Monique, oh, we need some healing. Monique can't go there because she will die. Because she'll take damage. So we can't put her there, which is a bit of a nuisance. In fact, all of these are pretty useless. We can't do much with them. So how about we take the three single movement point things and then we hope that we get a minus two uh, sort of weakness thing uh it's only a minus one okay never mind. we'll take a minus one weakness thing um and then we'll just skip we just had a day of sitting about you know reading a nice book looking at the views being cold that kind of thing um okay maybe no, but he's already on that victory point thing we need healing because we can't put monique to there because she will freeze to death we need some healing. Okay, we'll take the one and the one and the two. These are unlucky card draws, it has to be said. Um, okay, right, end that phase. We'll take a minus two. And again, we can't do anything. We can't do anything. We can't move you because you've got two health. And if you move up here, you're going to possibly die. And we can't move you to there because you will die. Because you're going to take one hit, one sort of health hit. And you've only got one. Uh, okay, right, skip that. Can we have some healing cards, please? Can we have some healing cards? There we go. Right, this might allow us to move around a little bit. Thank you. We'll take those two and we'll take... Uh, we'll take that one. End that phase. We'll take a minus one weakness thing. And then Monique can heal. And she can heal. So she's got a health of three. And then we move her to there. That means we've stopped on that. So we pick up the other four points. And we are now... When it says get back to and return to any camp. Ah, okay. Any camp at all. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. We can absolutely do that. So, And then Monique's minus one sort of um, weakness point thing is on that card there. Which is absolutely fine. Right. Okay. More healing is required. Oh, it's going to get very bad on the mountain tomorrow's weather is going to be bad it's got a little kind of foot symbol i imagine that means we can't move possibly it's on the entire mountain it's on the entire mountain okay right we will see what tomorrow brings in terms of weather so we'll take that we do need her to move into there i think so she could move in that to be quite useful because otherwise she's going to possibly die so we'll take the one point to get her over there and then the two just in case we get another minus two weakness thingamajig. So in that phase, yes, we will take that. You can then heal up a bit and then you can go to there. Okay, so you're now hiding out over here. We have 10 points. Okay, that's fine. So we picked up, yeah, did we get one from there and four from there and five from there or something? So now we'll end the day. Okay, so Mike is on one health, but because at a camp, he can't go lower than that. That's fine. Um, these are all pointless. We'll take a minus one. I mean, could we 
I think you have to I think you have to end your turn on one of those to pick up the points. So if we could get there and there and then get back to a camp, we'd be okay. That'd give us six. That'd give us seven. And math with pen, six plus seven, everybody, is 13. I know that. That's how numbers work. Um, and 13 added to 10 would be 23. Get back here. We get a shiny gold medal. But we need to heal up. We have no healing. We, we, we've got no healing at all. So our people are really weak. We've not done the proper prep stuff. Maybe what we were supposed to do is, were we supposed to go down here and heal up a bit and then climb back up again? Is that what we were supposed to do, rather than rely on the cards? Okay, well, we've, yeah, we've made the choice now, so end the day. And, yeah, it was just a very bad day yesterday in terms of weather. Uh, we'll take the one teeny tiny healing point, which isn't very much, is it? So maybe Monique could have that up to three, and then she could move to there. So if we give her three and one, she can move to there. She can take the hit of two health because she'll be on three by the time we heal her uh yeah so in that phase we'll have how much movement have we got it takes two to get there and we've got four so do you know what minus two get rid of that remove that from the pool so monique go there and then there's an alarming red thing around you which implies death but don't worry we're going to sort it monique there we go so now if we end the day does that get us up to some more points? Does that get us another six? I don't fully understand. Hang on, that's a seven. And that, hang on a minute, that's only gone up by one. I don't really understand how we're doing this, but okay. Oh, is it each person? Hang on a minute, hang on. Are you bringing back six? And you're bringing back, no, is it five and six? Oh, so we need them both to be at the summit to get 20 and then come back down again. Okay, I don't know if that's going to happen, to be honest. I don't even know if we can get 16 at the minute. We've got 11. Okay, right, end the day. And, right, healing cards. Thank goodness. We will take those, thank you. And a big movement card. Right, so, end that phase. The weather is looking particularly awful. Um... We can't... Do we have our tents? I'm not entirely sure we have tents. But, Monique, you can... Uh, oh, hang on, weakness points. Hang on a minute. Um, We'll take... That's only one point to get there. But you are going to lose... Oh, you're going to lose a lot of health. You're going to lose a lot of health. Okay, we'll take minus one move. You can come back down here because the weather is so utterly frightful. Um, and... Yeah, you can heal. Monique can heal up. And also, Mike can heal up. Although, do we just give it all to Monique? And she can sort of run up to the top and grab some more points. Do you know what? No, Monique, you can heal up a great deal. And then we'll skip. Okay, we've not got many days left. <laughs> this is a tricky game. I kind of feel like we've done this bit wrong. I think we should have healed up down here. And then come back up. I think now it's becoming a little bit... A little bit too challenging, if you like. We need both of them to get to there. To get six... No, yeah. To get 16 points. Because that's where the 8 is. So they both need to get to there. And then come back down again. And we haven't got much time. Or much health. Okay, if we could get to here, that's another camp. So let's try and move people over to there, shall we? Uh, and then at least we can sort of move up from there. So hang on. We'll have 2 and 2 and 2 end that phase we'll take a oh it's three to get to there bother and five to get to there okay we'll take a minus one and monique you can make your way over here hooray you're at a camp so you can't die which is good and you're not going to lose any points from your weakness thing then we need to bring mike up okay so mike you need five movement points which you don't have Botherations. Okay, right. We need to get him up there. That's the next big goal. Mike has got to go and join uh, join Monique at that camp. But we just don't have the movement points. We'll take whatever that thing is. And that and that. Okay, do that then. We'll take a minus two weakness point. We'll apply that to Mike. I don't know what it does. And we'll end the day. Okay. Right, that's a bit better. Two, 
three, four. Again, we can't, we can't get there. We can't get up to this bit. We haven't got enough movement points. Um, yeah, that's going to require two. And then, oh no, it's only another one. No, we might be okay. We might be okay. So we'll take two and three. Oh no, but we're going to have to deal with the thing. Hang on, four. This, this could end badly, couldn't it? Okay, if we take... It's three movement points. Okay, so if we take a minus one weakness point thing, and then we send Mike over here, right, we have 14 points. So if they both just go to there, and then come back down again, it's going to be fine. We'll then get 16 points, and then it'll all be good. Um, I mean, yeah, 18. How do you get 18? Oh, somebody at the top and somebody there would get 18, wouldn't it? Because that's how numbers work. Okay, right. End the day. Let's see what we have. The final three cards. Oh, dear. Okay, right. Uh, we can't do much with it. Uh, do you know what? Minus one movement point thing. And we'll just we'll just take that hit, I think. And uh, pff, let's heal Monique up for the sake of... There you go, Monique. You feel a bit better. And then it can come right back down again because of the horrible weather. Okay, skip the turn. End the day. We're on day 13 now. Day 13. Although... The weather at the top bit of the mountain, which is where we are right now, looks pretty good for the next four days. So maybe now is when we should make a bit of a break for it. So we are going to need to stock up on some health stuff. That's fine. And then two points can get Monique to just there. So yeah, okay, do that then. So Monique, you can be the one to go first. That's fine. So end that phase. We will take a zero weakness point thing. And then you can heal up, and you can heal up, and then you can move to there. So you are going to take two points. So next time, we need to make sure that we heal you, because otherwise you're going to be dead. And then it's game over, and everybody is sad. Right, okay, so end the day, because we can't do much else. We need some healing cards. There are no healing cards. Okay, unless we have... Ah, that allows us to come back down, look. That allows us to come back down the mountain quite quickly. So if we try and go up, that's two to go up. And then, hang on, this could be quite good. Take as many points of movement as we can. So that's, hang on, how many have we got? We can go up seven and down eight. Okay, but if we go up here, that's going to be up two. So that means we can then go back down six. Do you know what? We're going to try this. We're going to give this a go. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll pick those cards, please. Maybe. We don't want any weakness points, I don't think. Because this might allow Monique to get to just here and then go right back to base camp again and not die. Uh, I think that's what's going to happen. So it's going to be two points. She's got, yeah, two points to go up. So say that one there. So that'll get her there. And then that's going to be another three. She could get to the top. She could, in theory, get to the top. But then she's got to come back down three, and she'll get here, and then she'll die. Okay, so I think then, hang on. So again, which one of these do we pick? Up there is two. That uses two. And then she can come down three. Uh, do you know what? We're going to use zero. I don't fully understand how this is going to work, but... we Oh, she could pitch a tent. She could pitch a tent just there. Or maybe even at the top. I don't know exactly. Is the tent like the camp? Does the tent keep you alive? I think it might do. But I think it gives you one. Oh, hang on. She could go there. And that'll give her... What's the weather going to be like? We might be okay. Monique, if this doesn't work out, I apologise. Because it involves numbers. I'm not very good at numbers. Or climbing mountains. So when I'm combining the two, it's probably going to end badly. But I think if we put you there... Okay, you've made it to the top. We have 17 points. And now, you can't pitch a tent. Not enough universal or upward movement points. Uh, oh! Oh, it's three. Oh, hang on. Undo. Edit, undo. No, bail on that. We'll go just here, look. We'll go here, and we will have ourselves a tent. So if we pop a tent just there that might then keep us alive for a bit 
uh, and then we could possibly go there next time. We're going to need a lot of a lot of downward. No, do you know what? It's not worth it, is it? We've got 15. Let's get you back down here. Moving a climber there and back is not the same as moving an undo. You still use movement points. If you do not intend, please undo instead. No, 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 no. I want her to come back. That's fine. So she's got to that point and then she's come back. And she can hide out here and it's fine. And now that means that the attention goes to Mike. Mike, you need to get to here as well. Preferably there, but here is also good. Um, okay, so right now you're not going to go anywhere, Mike. Because that's going to be bad. Okay, skip. End of day. Uh, we will take... <sighs> No no healing points. No healing points of any kind. Okay, that doesn't help at all, game. Because Mike only has one health. And if he goes out here, he is going to end up being quite dead. Um, okay. We can't do much with this, then. This is effectively just... We'll just get rid of those three. Just do that. We'll take a minus two hit to it. And we'll just skip that. Yeah, absolutely. Just ignore that. There we go. Farewell. One... Healing point. Great. Yay. Okay, he can get to here. And then maybe he could go there and then try and climb back down. Okay, that's what we need to try. We'll have that. It's two points to go up there. So if we take three to do that and then take one of those. These two, I notice, have good downward, the downward sort of uh, down the mountain points. So maybe we keep those for next time. And make sure that he can very quickly get back down to base camp. And then we'll just sort of go, do you know what? We've got 16 points. That's absolutely fine. Yay for a bronze. <laughs> we'll take the bronze medal and not being dead. Thank you. So we'll do that. Yes. End that phase. Take a minus one because we have no choice. Mike can heal up a little bit. Mike could then go here for two points. Okay, Mike, go there for two points. And now... If you pitch a tent, you will be okay next turn because it's going to give you one point back. So you're going to lose two, but gain one because of your tent. Okay, right. This is good. So now, can't do anything else. End the day. Right, Mike is not looking great, but we have got a great big kind of exciting fancy healing card thing. And tomorrow is the last day. Okay, so we'll take that. And we will take that. Uh, oh, no, hang on. That's to get him back down. He needs to go up here first. We need two to go up the mountain. So take that. So two to go up. That'll get him up there. And then he needs to come back down here for three. So take that, I think. Okay, Mike, if this doesn't work... I apologise. I'm very sorry, Mike. But again, mountain climbing, not really my thing. So end that phase. We'll take no weakness points whatsoever. We shall heal you up a bit, Mike. Okay, so you're a little bit healthier. You can go to here. I'm just thinking, is it worth him going up there for five? Can he get there? He can only go up three. Okay, do you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna get sixteen. We're gonna go for bronze. Hooray! We've got sixteen, and then you can come back down three. Do you know what? It's fine. Yeah, I, I know, game. I know. We've moved them there. We've moved them back again. We've got sixteen. We've got ourselves a nice bronze, you know, medley awardy thing. That's fine. That's fine. I'm okay with that. Right. End of the day, and we've got. Yeah, this is the final thing. This is the final thing. Okay, end the phase. Uh, we're not going to move. We'll pick that one because why not, eh? And um, yeah, we're just going to kind of uh, skip the entire day's activities. We're just going to hang out at the camp and, you know, pop the kettle on, have a nice chat, look out the tent window at the view. And there we go. We, um, yeah, that was, that was tricky. I didn't fully understand how the points worked. It's the kind of level of height you go and then come back down to a base camp. I didn't fully understand that. But, uh, yep, okay, right, marvellous. 16 points. We got a bronze. I'm taking that. I'm taking that, and we're going to run with it. I'm going to roll with it. I'm going to roll with it down the mountain and become a great big snowball. Okay, chapter three, expect the unexpected. Mayday, mayday. There was an accident in another team. Lead the rescue mission. I'm not sure I'm the person to lead a rescue mission 
to go and help a sort of stranded, troubled climber. But OK, I'll give it a jolly good go. I apologise in advance to the climber who's in a bit of peril because it might not go entirely well. So bronze save the climber at the very last moment. Silver is save the climber and gold is save them quickly. OK, where are they? Where is the climber? Oh, they're there, look. Is that them? Yes, they're there. Oh, hang on, time's ticking. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, OK, right, hang on. Now we have to think, oh, this is awful. Is Spacebar pause? No, Spacebar isn't pause. OK, oh, dear. Right, hang on, this is going to go horribly wrong. I, I suspect maybe we might need to do this a few times because death is going to happen. We're already 30 seconds down and we haven't moved. Um, I don't know, Monique, you heal up a bit. I think we go down to work our way back up. Don't go up and over. Go down and then go along a bit. So if we go to here, we're going to lose two health. But then we could put a tent there to help us just sort of stay alive a bit. And then we can lose our point and that's fine. Okay, end of the day. Come on, come on, come on. The clock is ticking. Pick three cards. Um, we'll have that one and that one and that one. That's a lot of movement. And the weather is not quite so bad. So okay, end that phase. We'll go to there with you. I'll choose weakness, points, botheration. What have we got? Seven. Okay, and zero. Just get to the person as quick as we can. Okay. So Monique's going to take a point of damage, but I think that's fine. Right. We could do with some healing, please, game. You appear to be not giving us that. Two and two, and then down the hill nice and quick. Uh, we'll take a minus one of those. Right. We're here for three points. Hello there. We've reached the accident place. I assume we've picked up the injured climber. Now transfer them to base okay we can go down the hill to here okay that's fine so we're going to take a point of damage but we're okay we might need to do some healing or get to our tent next time but okay the weather is good for tomorrow okay end of the day give us some healing okay good healing we'll take that we'll take that we will take that please uh minus one of those means we can't oh we can move to here okay and we'll heal up and we'll heal up Okay, we can't do anything else. End of the day. Right, we need to move quickly, I think. Uh, we'll take some healing. We'll take that and that. Please give us a zero. Ah, botherations. Okay, that's not overly helpful. Heal up a bit, Monique, because you're not in a good way. And you can move three. So go to here. Can you get to there? Can you get to there? Confirm the end of the day. Uh, pick these three things. End the phase. Choose witness ones. Minus one. Transfer the injured climber to the base. Is that... Hang on, what base? What base? Oh, hang on. Do they need to go down there? Oh. Oh, okay. No, hang on. I didn't know that. I thought it just meant the base that we were at. I thought it meant that base. Uh, no, do you know what? We're going to do that again. I, that, that is an entirely clear game. I thought... Yeah, I think it's down there, look. There's a pointy arrow. I thought it meant the base where we started. Okay, no, that does change things a little bit, doesn't it? So get them and then just kind of sprint down the mountain as quick as you can. Okay, no, we're going to change that round. I'm, I'm going to go back and do that again because, uh, yeah, I didn't understand that. I wouldn't have gone that way before. So right, hang on, let us just go to wibbly wobbly parallel alternate dimension where different things happened. Right, okay, we're back again. Let's do this very quickly. So now we know that there is a time limit. We can just get on with it immediately. Because last time, yeah, it took about 30 seconds for me to realise what was going on. So let us begin. So the clock is ticking. They're still just there. We will just take a lot of movement points. We'll take a lot of movement points. And that means we can go to here, I think. Um, hang on, choose weakness points minus one. Uh, again, we'll get Monique doing it. So you can move to there. And then you can have a little tent on the go to keep you alive okay end of the day you're in your tent that's all very good um heal heal and move yes okay we'll um we'll take do you know what we'll do minus one of those can we get up there no we can only move two bother okay we'll uh, we'll have that and we'll have that we'll heal up a few times that's fine right okay we lost that movement point but never mind right climb up and that and that end phase go to our oh, minus one movement point botherations go to here we're going to take some damage tomorrow looks okay the day after looks horrendous right okay we need to get some movement points in to go and grab the person health wise we're looking okay so yes we'll have that um we'll have no weakness points right now grab you and then we can go back down three 
Yeah, okay, that's fine. So we've got the injured person. Now we just need to get them right down to the bottom of the mountain. We'll take a couple of um, a couple of healing points. Oh, hang on, that's three down the mountain. Okay, uh, we'll have minus one weakness point. They're a bit of a nuisance. We shall heal up a bit. And then, yeah, we'll just come down. Just come straight down and down here. Yeah, there's a camp there. So we can go to there, into that camp. Okay, we're going to take a bit of damage. Monique is fine. We'll have that, that, and that. End that phase. Minus one movement point thing. So we can get to the camp, and then we can heal up. Right, okay, end of the day. The clock is still ticking. But as long as we just get them back, even if I get a bronze, I'm fine with that. Right, a great deal of movement points are required. Well, we'll take a minus two, please. Brilliant. Um... We can go down nine points. We can get all the way down here. Oh, crikey, that's magnificent. Yes, well done, Monique. Good abseiling there. That was very impressive. Um, and now we're just in healing. So, yeah, it's just it's just movement points. Just grab movement points as much as we can. Yeah, move down here. And there we go. We did it. Okay, so that last mission is a little bit different to the others. The others are a bit more sort of, you know, slow and steady and you kind of think about things and you work stuff out and you calculate the numbers and you've got time. Whereas that last one is a little bit more sort of, oh my goodness, me, there's a time limit. Quick, panic and run around and jump down the mountain very quickly. Okay, there we go. I think we did okay. Yeah, we rescued you. That You're very welcome. You're very welcome. We tried to do it as quick as we could and, you know, I think we did okay with it. Well, there we go. That was K2 Digital Edition and I will admit that I've never played the board game, so I'm not entirely sure how faithful a replication this is in terms of digital format, but overall, I really quite enjoyed that. That was a lot of fun. I do quite like in the campaign that there are different things that you have to do. I quite like the fact they've kind of got different campaign levels. It's not just a case of do the same thing again, but on a slightly bigger mountain or with slightly worse weather or whatever. There are kind of different goals with that, which I do quite like. And then, of course, you can go and do the single climb thing as well, if you wanted to do that just as a bit of a one-off challenge type thing. But yeah, I quite enjoyed that. I like the challenge with it. I like the challenge. I mean, sometimes it felt like we didn't get enough healing cards. I sometimes felt that maybe we could do with slightly more healing cards, but I'm going to assume that that's how the actual board game works. And it's a bit of a balance because, you know, maybe if you're up on the side of a great big mountain like the one we can see right there, maybe there isn't much opportunity to do some healing. I guess you can't heal so well when you're hanging off a mountain ledge or something. So I guess that kind of represents that in a way, I assume. But do you know what? Overall, it was a lot of fun. The challenge was quite good. There were different kind of objectives and things. The last level, which was a bit of a kind of a rush rescue thing, was a bit of a surprise. And we did OK on the second time round. So I think we got... Did we get silver bronze silver or was it bronze bronze silver i can't recall what we got in that first campaign level but whatever the case i think we did okay we didn't get ourselves a shiny gold medal but for somebody who doesn't know anything about mountains and for somebody who's not played the game before i think we did okay i think we muddled through just fine and we got ourselves some nice medals and we're just going to take those we're going to take those and then go and show them off to people and go do you know what well, look we climbed a mountain and we saved somebody isn't that brilliant look at us we're fancy mountain climbing people now and that's all very exciting so yes i think with that done we will wrap things up for now with our little look at the k2 digital edition hopefully you did enjoy this if you did please do leave a like that would be most marvellous indeed and also if you're not already then please do subscribe to keep up today with all the other bits and bobs and nonsense that we get up to in the geek cupboard but for now thank you very much for joining me in the geek cupboard and i'll see you next time i really hope i don't have to send children down into coal mines or whatever because i would feel like a terrible person hello robot and i shall call you alan still some homeless people still hungry people Still sick, people. Okay, if you try and reach London, you will end up frosty and dead. Great big human lollipop.